I've been watching Marie Kondo and she's starting to make a lot of sense. I need to declutter my life, my cupboards, my closet, my wardrobe, my drawers, my... <sighs> so I've lived here for about a year and before that I had uh, seven years in Kingston and before that I was in Melbourne. So two big moves in a decade, yes. And within that decade, I've had stuff stored in our family's shed. And it's not just a shed, it's like an apple shed. And I still haven't finished. There were 25 apple boxes, bins, you know, the big ones. You need a forklift to move around. Let's just say the charity shops have done really well out of me. So I think um, I just need to start with clothes. Here we go. Eh. I'm scared mojo. I'll give you just a little bit of a tour of my dressing room. Two big cupboards. It's making, it's not, it's not helping me get to where I want to get because I've just got all this stuff that is in the way and yeah. Hence Marie Kondo. Hanging clothes, shoes, scarves. So I'm gonna empty all these out and put them on my bed. Wait a minute, I have to get the ones out of my drawers. Shoot, and then I'll show you the bed. So I started this about three o'clock, which is probably a really silly thing to do. About three o'clock, I tend to get motivated. About, it takes that long just to I can uh, nail it. I'll show you what we've got. Oh my god. And this is after a cull. Shit snacks. Two boxes of scarves. How many people need two boxes of scarves? What the fuck? Okay, so I pick up and I say does this spark joy? Does it fit? Is it still in good shape? Does it stink under the arms? Does it have any stains on it? Do I want to bring it with me into the future? And if no is the answer to any of those, then it goes. Well, if, you know, yes or no answer, you know what I mean. So two piles, keep and destroy. Donate. And maybe throw out, yeah. They might be a throw out pile too, cause like some of these things might be a little bit gross. All right, let's get started.